Are you ready to rock the best proxy on the internet, the most affordable and the best? It is for you, diving into proxy for you. All right, welcome to a proxy for you. No pun intended here, but I think you're really going to like this. We're going to dive into what a proxy is so you understand everything. We're going to get into some of the information about it. Then we're going to take a look at a competitor, see what's going on, and see the services we have so you can get the cheapest, best proxy on the internet. Let's go. This really is your gateway to proxy for you. So get ahead of the curve. Get your digital footprint out there. Don't worry about geo-blocking restrictions anymore. Maybe even save some bandwidth. What the heck is a proxy, you're asking, though? Why would I get one? Well, a proxy simply is your gateway to the Internet. And you'll say, well, okay, that it? Like, that's fine. And it's different from a VPN as proxy is a gateway. VPN encrypts traffic. So those are the two fundamental differences. But a proxy is your gateway to the Internet. And you can think of it like this. Let's say you have one route to an address or a building. Then you say, man, that got blocked off by construction. Maybe that's a site you can't get to. Maybe, you know, you're an employer. You want to protect your employees or kids from, some, you know, something. Maybe you want to go a different route. Well, you can't. That is blocked off. So you got to use the GPS, and you're like, oh, there's different locations. There's different ways. You can think of different gateways to get to that address. Proxy opens up that possibility. So some of the reasons you would use it is you can say bandwidth. You can get past geo-blocking, and what I call geo-blocking means, hey, there's a site out there if you're in the U.S. that you can't access. You know, maybe there's a crypto project that you like. You just can't get there, and you're like, man, you know, if only I had a way, you know, around that. Well, now you do. It can also be used for bandwidth purposes. It can be used to protect employees or children or stop your employees from looking at that bad stuff at work. What are you doing? And in addition to that, I think it's an amazing technology to have. So if you want to do things like scrape data, you want to get past geo restrictions, you want to be a boss, well, you can. Now there's different types of proxies that you can utilize. So we have to talk about that. So we got the residential proxies right here, me sitting chilling here at my residence. There's different address ways to get to my address too. So we have different proxies here, but we have 5 million IPs, seamless approach with other rotation. You enjoy an awesome level of security like no other. Then there's data center proxies. And hey, maybe you got a whole data center, computers, wires going everywhere. I've been there. You can get expert certified business IPs. Maybe you want to go super, or let's say you're rocking it on your phone. Pew. You want to be super techie and let all your friends know you can rock the mobile proxies that's a smart way to do it. And there's different things I've used proxies for. I've used them for, you know, accessing Upwork. I've used them for crypto projects. I've used them to get past geo blocks. And I think it's great. So we have the residence right here. This is for long use, stress-free payments. It's pay as you go. It's flexible. So if you're like, I'm not going to use a proxy for a little bit of time. No big deal. No problem. Also, data center made for real world app. That is also pay as you go. And same with the mobile here. Plus, it's trusted by travelers. If you're going overseas, you can't access something. It's trusted by sellers. If, you know, you are trying to track what your competitor is doing. A lot of people who are software as a service utilize this. And even analysts, we got the trust pilot reviews crushing it. And this is putting you ready to success. So hopefully you understand what a proxy is, gateway to the Internet, why you'd use it, you know, to get past geo blocks improved bandwidth sometimes and even accessibility and you can do it on your mobile phone even so you want to rock your free trial you can right here also we have the rotating proxies so let's check that out all right the rotating proxies like in my chair except we're doing that with ip addresses which think of an ip address like the specific location the way like every computer has an ip to get to the internet like every house has an address so you can rotate that to be like moving to a new house, but you're still in your same house, but your computers move shooting out to new house and people are like, wait, what, what locations? He at? So we have the starter with $2 50 cents. That's super cheap for one gigabyte. You can also go advance and rush it for a hundred dollars and keep going up and up and up. So what do you get? 50 gigs for a hundred and boom, 1500 one terabyte. That's a lot of data rocking it. 
guess what? There's no expiry dates. Do it in any country you want. So whether you're in Bali, whether you're in Thailand, whether you're in America or the UK, I, I don't know if my accents are very good, but whether you're in any of those places, you can rock it right there. Easy rotation, IP whitelist, let's go. And there's no hidden fees. There's no like, oh, okay, well, you got to pay this or that, you know, an extra cost. And you get target scraping advice so you can pull the data you need where you need it. Now, you're going to say, why do I need residential proxies? Why not just get, you know, or, or why do I even need rotating proxies in the first place? Well, this selects specific countries, states, zip codes, anything ensuring 100% privacy and security and anonymity. So you're completely anonymous. You can, can you know, go wherever you want. You are not going to, you know, get the ban hammer potentially from places that have recognized sites that have recognized your IP address. You can go do what you need to do. This is really, if I were to break it down, you do it for unrestricted browsing. And you can find the FAQs here, how residential proxies work and all the information. So I'd read this in your own space, in your own time. Also, if you have any questions, you can definitely click on, and I would, a contact name, email, phone. What services do you provide? Tell us a bit about yourself. You know, hey, I'm just a dude trying to browse the internet or we're a multi-billion dollar corporation. And you also have the opportunity for affiliate right now. So let's say you do it, you start browsing, you're like, man, this is awesome, but you're good. that's what you're gonna say. They, they crush in it on Trustpilot, let's go. Then you can start earning simply by letting other people know. This is the best option. Now, what other options out there? So I've compared them with Mars proxies, and I see the residential, the data center, the ISPs, and the mobile proxies, but it just doesn't have the same level, in my opinion, that proxy for you does. And while this is okay, I want the best service possible. So it's proxy for you. So that sums it up what a proxy is, why proxy for you is awesome, the different types of proxies you can get and how you can use them as well as the rotating proxies. And if you have any more questions, you want to learn a little bit more, you can let me know in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell to know when I post more videos, questions or comments, let me know down below. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.